Hello, this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video, and another video inside of Stampy's lovely world. And today in this video, I am actually going to be joined by more people than just Lee Bear. The last few videos, it's just been me and Lee, and oh, well, by the looks of it, it looks like just me. No, no one's come to say hello. Why is no one running in my bedroom? Here we go. The first tentative steps <laughs> from uh, Chloe. How are you doing, Chloe? Welcome to the video. Are you feeling good today? Are you okay? You feeling good? Yeah, she's, she's feeling fine. She's feeling okay. And Lee... Was that really necessary? <laughs> what's wrong with your normal entrance through the painting? Did you really? Oh, now look what's happened. We've got ourselves a soggy chicken. <laughs> oh dear, I am rather partial to a soggy chicken. How are you doing, Esther? Oh, all her, all her feathers are all rustled up. And we're also uh, being joined by Wee Wee from Wee Wee Gaming's fame. And how are you doing today? Are you okay? Are you feeling good? There we go. A bit of enthusiasm. That's what I like to see. <laughs> anyway, let's all have our, our breakfast then, shall we? Uh, let's go and uh, have our cake. Oh, here we go. Lee's doing his, his standard entrance now. Hello. Good morning, Lee. Time for our cake. Right, put it on the floor, then everyone just dive in. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> I think I certainly got the, the lion's share of that cake. <laughs> and Wee Wee is just eating a load of square peas, by the look. Massive square peas, I think that's what they are. Anyway, let's go play the, the egg game. I can see there's an egg down here, which is S that uh, has freshly laid, which is excellent. Uh, <laughs> sorry, these jokes crack me up. Sorry, these yolks crack me up. Anyway, there, there's an egg for you there, Wee Wee. And uh, I think Lee might have a couple on him as well, so he can uh, pass one. There's one in there for you, Chloe, if you want to go and grab that one inside my bedroom. And at the end of the game, if you don't know, uh, is to throw an egg to try and knock off one of the paintings uh, that are on the, the blocks around the place. And I believe, uh, yeah, there's only three left. There's one there, one there, and one there. And the green one, that's the that's the most difficult one. And hopefully one of us uh, can hit it today. We've got four tries between us. We've got one try each. And I'm watching you, Lee. Go on. Throw the egg when you're ready. Oh, he's going for a 360. That's never a good idea. Ooh, that was actually pretty close, though. That wasn't bad for a 360. Right, Wee Wee, you are up. Go for the second throw. So you don't have to go for the green one. You can go and try and hit any of the, the ones that you want. Ooh, oh, slightly over it. I always get under it. You got slightly over it. Okay, Chloe, it is your turn. You can go for any of the ones you want. You can go for the purple one, the green one, or the one that's inside of my, my first shelter. I don't know what color that one is. And everyone's gone for that green one and that was so close right I might as well follow the trend then because of peer pressure I'm gonna go for the difficult green one as well then let's go for a run up then and oops sorry wee wee didn't mean to <laughs> run backwards into you right run and jump ooh, ooh, ooh. no it wasn't to be right forget that stupid one next video I'm gonna go for the easy one down there so I can hit one and oh oh I still laid another egg. I think that might be fate. I think that says Stampy Cat can have one more go. I think that's what Esther was saying. Right, let's do it. Let's get that stupid green one. It's too difficult. And... No, forget it. Forget it. Let's go to the Love Garden, shall we? <laughs> that's enough of the, the silly egg game. We'll play it uh, again in the next video. And oh, why is the... Why is the door open here? Hilda? Henry? How you do? <laughs> Hi, Hilda. Hi, Henry. I love the way they run and say hello to me. Look at that. As soon as I come in. Oh, it's all right, Lee. It's fine. They're, they're all friends in here. So oh, Henry's making a run for it. Right. Make sure we leave that door shut. I've just about got all of the, the snow cleaned up from in here. And uh, let's go to the, the love garden and add someone to it. And if you're new to my channel and you don't know what the love garden is, uh, basically at the start of all of my videos in my lovely world, uh, I look at a sign with uh, someone's name on it and uh, say thank you to them for some reason. But today I am breaking tradition and I'm not adding one person. I am adding three. I am adding Kingfisher 8, uh, Queenfisher 6 and Flower Gypsy. And uh, the reason I'm adding them is because they made an amazing foosball table and you can see some pictures uh, uh, here on the screen and uh, it's not actually a football table uh, it's actually a cake ball table and uh, one team is all Stampy Cat and uh, the other team is all Lee and you've got to kick a cake around and you can see them here uh, dressed up as Stampy and Lee as well and there's uh, all of my friends as well on the, the sideline cheering along the game and I thought this was just about the coolest thing I've ever seen and I want one and so thank you very much uh, Kingfisher, Queenfisher and uh, Flower Gypsy uh, for sending me the picture and making the table and and welcome to my love garden. Anyway, we've got to be quick now. We've wasted way too much time already because today I am going to try and do something I have never done before. We are breaking records today, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to go and try 
and a hundred percent complete building a minigame in my funland and playing it all within one video. I am not lying. I am telling the truth. That is what the challenge is going to be. Uh, we get to see where I'm going to complete the challenge, but that's what the, the attempt is going to be. And I'm going to do that from the accompaniment of a dog called Corey today. And oh, it looks like I think you picked the one that I was going to say anywhere, Lee. It's, uh, I haven't taken Corey with me in a while. And uh, here's Corey right down here, very curiously watching uh, to decide which dog I was going to take with me. And so let's go. Let's head over to the uh, the Funland, and on my way, I'm going to very quickly explain uh, what it is we're going to be building. We are going to be uh, building the Tower Tumble mini game, and it's very very simple, which is <laughs> why I'm going to be able to build it uh, in one episode. And you're all going to be very glad to hear that there is zero redstone involved. Woo! <laughs> That's my kind of mini game. <laughs> means nothing's going to go wrong. Yeah. So the idea is there's going to be one very tall thin tower, only one block wide, but very tall. And on the side of it, there's going to be trap doors the entire way up. And you need to flap your way up to the top of the tower. You know the thing you can do where you kind of, you flap a trap door up and then you jump and flap it back down and you can uh, gradually make your way to the top? Yeah, so you're going to have to do that. But because there's uh, four sides, there's going to be, whoa, look at all of these. Oh yeah, there's going to be one uh, like row of trap doors on each side and it's going to be a race to the top. But the thing is... Not only do you flap your own ones to get up, you can also flap your opponent's ones to try and knock them down. So you can't hit each other, no violence in this game, but you can try and slow each other's down by uh, trying to flap their trap doors down to knock them lower. And so at the bottom, there's going to be a big pit of water. So uh, if you do accidentally fall down, then it shouldn't be too deadly. But that's it. That's all the game is going to be. So if we are super, super speedy fast, we should hopefully uh, be able to get it all completed uh, in just today's video. So... Uh, Corey, you can come and you can sit down here. Because we're building tall, uh, it's probably not a good idea for you to be running around the place. And uh, this is where we're going to be building. So uh, I guess the first thing to do is to build the, the big pit of water. And uh, it's going to be uh, 12 by 12, I think. So if I start about here and go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then do the same in this direction. So that would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then back this way and uh, go and try and link the, the entire thing up. So there's going to be a massive uh, pit of water here, three blocks deep, so when you fall it won't hurt you. And then that way also, once you get to the top, you can have a, a victorious plunge into the water just to <laughs> celebrate. You can just go and do a big old belly flop and try and land in here. So uh, all we need to do is go and try and dig out uh, this massive pit here and uh, fill it full of water. Then I literally just have to do one straight tower up to the top and put the uh, trap doors down. And then that's going to be the, the game 100% done. And then we can have a, a little tournament uh, of it at the, the the end of the video but where are all of my minecraft helpers they were behind me a second ago and we're not going to get this done if i got to build the entire thing by myself <laughs> i'm sure they're they're slowly but surely making their their way over to me and it doesn't matter i can go and try and get some some of the the early work done myself so let's go and uh, just do the uh, the outside of it just to make sure the pattern's going to line up so i'm going to be building it out of orange and white wool uh, just so it fits in with the the stampy cat colors and oh look did you see that a tree just grew behind me. It just popped up just as I turned around. <laughs> yeah, the, the orange and yellow uh, colours are kind of a bit of a classic in my world. You can see there the SS Stumpy with the uh, the orange and uh, white uh, cells. Anyway, let's go and build the, the first row then. So it's just going to be uh, orange and white the whole way round here. Uh, to make a, a big square. And uh, then uh, I'm going to... I guess if I place the water first... Maybe, and then dig a... Actually, no, because then it's going to be really annoying trying to place all of the, the rest of the blocks when the, the wart is going to be in the way. So I guess I'll, I'll build all of the, the walls in first, and then I go and place the, the water down. But the only problem is, because I want the water to be right at the top, I'm going to have to fill that layer back in with just dirt or something so I can place the water, and then I can just go and uh, destroy it all again, just so, uh, yeah, there's not, like, a, a load of dirt in the way. Anyway, where, where are my Minecraft helpers, though? Are they... They're all still in the game. I think that they, they just didn't want to build. I think that, I reckon they're just over somewhere else in my fun land playing a game and having fun while I'm here doing all of the work. <laughs> we're, trying to, we're trying to set a new record here. We're trying to, for the first time, completely build and play a game in one video and I'm having to do it all by myself. Maybe I should start playing, uh, paying my Minecraft helpers. Maybe I should start paying them in cakes. <laughs> Maybe they're all bitter because I ate the, the entire cake this morning so they're not going to come over and join me. It doesn't matter though. I'm actually doing amazingly good progress. For once, I've not got distracted. Normally, whenever I, I set about building something, like whatever exciting going on around me uh, just completely distracts me and then I end up not getting any work done. But I've, I've focused. 
I've, I've just been non-stop building and I can see someone. I can see our first arrival. Hello, Wee Wee Gaming. <laughs> Wee Wee Gaming's managed to make it over, even though the sun's about to go down. <laughs> what a trooper, he's made it all the way over here. And you know, I'm not even... I'm not even that far off finishing the game. That is literally how simple it is. This is this is a game that I reckon anyone watching this video could so easily build just as quickly as I'm building it now. Because it literally is basically a pit of water and one straight tower. And you don't even need the pit of water. I'm just doing that as a safety feature. If you want to play the, the extreme dangerous version, you could not have a pit of water. But <laughs> I don't fancy doing the extreme dangerous version. <laughs> I fancy doing the, the tame, uh, yeah, the tame easy version as uh, <laughs> my kind of version. So uh, I need to break away this layer and then I think if I break away one more layer underneath and then I can do a, a funky pattern I can have it uh, like a, a like a checkered pattern with a white and orange wall and uh, that could be the the bottom of the uh, the bottom of the pit and then I go and uh, start filling in all of the the water and uh, then I'll hop up and start doing the the actual tower I think the only thing that is going to take uh, a decent amount of time uh, is putting all of the the trap doors in uh, because building the actual tower should be really quick uh, but we're gonna have to go around at the end and put in all of the um Oh, the trap doors, and because the trap doors are going to go on every single different side, uh, it's probably going to take a while to do all of them. It's so easy with this pickaxe, though. It's making it uh, so easy just to destroy all of the blocks so fast. And I think I can see an elfly. And hello, Wee Wee Gaming. There we go. <laughs> Finally, we got a, a team effort. I think they might have had a, a few problems loading in their chunks on their way over here, but it doesn't matter. Here we go. We've, we've got two of us here. All we need to do is wait for uh, Miss Minecraft Xbox Live, uh, Xbox Live Arcade to get over here, and uh, we can all. Work Work together so uh shall we oh hello lee <laughs> there we go lee jumped in and did the final block he jumps in and goes whoo what a team effort <laughs> and there's chloe as well on the horizon right let's get going then lads let's get going let's destroy all of the walls and then we can go and do a, a checkered pattern going down to the the floor i guess so if everyone just goes and destroys all the blocks away uh, i'll go and start filling in the walls just to make the whole thing look better this pickaxe is absolutely destroying the stone it's making it uh, so easy to get rid of it i just want to be careful though because if a googly falls down this pit there's not going to be <laughs> much chance of escape is there right so if i just do the uh, the checkered pattern like this and go the the whole way along uh, i don't need to bother doing the bottom row because that's where the floor is going to be and so if i just go like this is this going to be deep enough i i think three blocks deep should be deep enough <laughs> big uh, emphasis on the the should there <laughs> uh, hopefully should be enough so if i go and uh, do the the whole floor in like this and then if everyone goes and fills in the wall so you want to you want to make sure it follows the the same pattern lee so so it'll, it'll just go white orange white orange white orange the whole way round uh, so if you uh, don't, don't feel too much and make sure you stick to the same pattern so if it's white then you want to put orange next to it oh no i don't think it will work on the corners no i think i think you have done it right lee you have done it right <laughs> i take it back carry on you obviously know what you're doing better than me <laughs> and this is why alpha lee is the leader of the the minecraft helpers <laughs> the most dedicated and loyal minecraft helper in all of the world i love them all though i love all of the the people that join me my my world would be a very sad and lonely place if i was always uh, with it by myself then again if i was technically by myself i'd still have like 12 dogs and mittens and hilda and henry and fred the friendly enderman and speaking of fred the friendly enderman we still need to to build his house you may remember a while ago i found a, a really cool location to build his house uh, basically on top of where my my crafting room is and uh, i've not done that so maybe uh, in my next video that might be something that i'm gonna build but uh, i need to kind of decide what what sort of room he would like maybe i have a a little chat to him what i reckon he would like in his room is dirt blocks everywhere that he can just pick up and move around <laughs> just play building blocks because that's that seems to be his number one hobby just picking up random blocks in my world and just moving them around the place and look at this we've got it almost completely filled in already so if everyone hops out once we've done those those final few blocks and uh, then we need to go and try and fill the the entire thing in with water so let me just uh, yeah use some dirt to, to pile out and i guess um i guess if we all fill in this row here with dirt so let me go get rid of that uh, bottom block if I can. Yeah, if we fill that... Oh, oh, there's a skeleton. There's a skeleton and a zombie. Oh, it's turned into a battle arena now. Let's try and take them out. There we go. <laughs> there's Levi Bodyguard jumping in. Right, if we jump up here, Lee, then if you get rid of that, that bottom block down there... And oh, has Lee already got out? 
Oh, he got out even quicker than me. Right, if I <laughs> hop out here, then get rid of that. And then if we try and fill in all of this layer with dirt, and then we can place the, the water on top of it, uh, so the water will be right up on the surface, and then we can go and destroy the dirt, and then the water's going to stay there. And then all I need to do then is uh, build the tower. Actually, I might as well build the, the beginning of the tower now. I need to work out where the middle is. Right, Corey, can you tell me where the middle is? Oh, okay, apparently the middle is right there. Thank you very much, Corey. <laughs> so let me go and fill in... Uh, was it here, the middle block? So that goes one, two, three, four, five. And then on the other side, one, two, three, four. Oh, no, I don't think there there is an exact middle, actually. Have I done this wrong? Let me count here. One, two, three, four, five. And then one, two, three, four. Oh, no, it did. there's not actually a, an exact middle, I don't think. Or is it there? No, I don't, I don't think that is right. I think this is about the closest we're going to get. But it doesn't really matter. We can maybe uh, just move the, the pit a little bit and uh, make it a little bit bigger. But that's where the, the tower is going to be. And I'm not going to jump up and build it yet. I'm going to wait until the, the water's in first. So then I can I can just test the, uh, the water to make sure uh, that we can land in it. And so once we have placed the water in, uh, I'm going to go and uh, pile up. And uh, then everyone else can uh, uh, start filling in uh, all of the water. And uh, I think Lee might be just uh, changing the shape of it a little bit uh, just to make sure it fits in. I wouldn't worry about that for now, Lee. If we just make sure we can play it and then we then we can have a little test to go. And then uh, afterwards we can we can make the, the pit a little bit bigger if we need to. Because I want to get the uh, the water in as quick as possible. So uh, I do have a, a whole load of buckets on me. I've got 10 buckets here. So let's go and uh, uh, fill all of these up. Oh, there we go. Chloe's already done an infinite water source. Jolly good. Hardly need to do anything now so uh, let's go and fill up all of our oh nope sorry that was my bad I think I I was a little bit too eager there I tried to <laughs> grab the water a little bit too quick well we need to take it in turns then take it in turns to take water and then <laughs> then that way we're not going to steal it uh, I'm not going to take too much and oh no I've got completely filled up now but let's go just go and throw some rubbish down there and uh, fill up all of these last few buckets of water and then if we go and place all of this down and then we can go and uh, get rid of the the dirt afterwards and uh, then that way uh, the water should just stay where it was. So let me go and get uh, all of my buckets along here. And then I can just go and fill all of this in. And we want to fill it in so there's no no streams of water. You see at the moment, it kind of looks a bit like a rapid. There's water all over the place. I never like it when it looks like that. It'd be good to, to have nice, complete, flat water. We don't want to do we wanna have don't do that. We don't want it to look like there's gonna be a massive storm in there or something. As so if we just go and place water. Or I guess if we go and do it all around the, the outside first would probably be the uh, the easiest way to do it. And there we go. Like one side has almost almost already completely finished it. And there we go. Look at that. It's already completely nice and smooth. I'm just gonna go and place down my my last few buckets here and now all we need to do is go and uh, start uh, start destroying the dirt and oh no no I heard that I heard the sizzle behind me but I was too slow reacting to it that was my own bad there <laughs> Corey's just sitting there not not at all phased by the fact of creeper blue I don't even think he noticed <laughs> oh dear, he's, he's just happy to, to to have been picked to come and join us in the video right so if everyone starts destroying the dirt while you're doing that, I'm going to go and try and climb up to the uh, the top of the tower and I'm going to build it. And this is going to go very, very high. So I should hopefully have a, enough wall on me. So I just want to literally alternate. So going, uh, oh, what's going on? Someone's getting hurt. Wee wee, I'd get out of the water if I was you <laughs> or put down a torch or something. There we go. Don't, don't, don't forget to breathe. Right, so if I go and pile up here, switching between uh, orange and white wall, and then all we need to do is go and put the, the trap. Oh, no. That wasn't a good start. That wasn't a good start. I've already fallen off. <laughs> I suppose what I could do is I could start putting the, the trap doors on one side and I, I can use that to get back up to the top. So uh, if I go and make a whole load of trap doors because I'm going to need a lot of these. So let's go and make uh, loads and loads and loads and loads of trap doors. So I can start uh, placing these up one side and I can kind of show you how the, the game is going to be played. So uh, they'd all be along like that. And then you basically need to, to flap a few of them up and then I can jump on it and then you can just jump and flap, jump and flap, jump and flap uh, in order to get up to the, the whole way up to the top. And I think I need to jump there and jump there. There we go. So I've already started one side, but for now, I'm just going to pull up and build the tower. And I don't know how high this is going to go. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to keep building until I get scared, until I feel like I'm too high and then I get vertigo. 
I think that's what I was. I'm, that's what I'm gonna do. And to be honest, I'm already a little bit scared. Look how look how small Alpha Lee looks already. All of my Minecraft helpers have suddenly turned to little tiny ants crawling underneath me. But this is gonna go quite high because I don't want people to to get to the tops too soon. I want it to be uh, quite a challenge to to get to the the top of the tower. And I can see a skeleton there desperately chasing after Wee Wee, and Wee Wee runs away. <laughs> it's quite a nice, just quite a nice view up here. I think when I get to the top, I'm just gonna have a, a bit of a look around and take in some of my my surroundings. I never uh, really take the time just to look around my lovely world and hopefully the water's gonna be oh! I slipped! I slipped and fell! I think that might be just about the, the right height anyway. I didn't get a chance to have a look around. Right, so if everyone just goes ma uh, goes and makes a whole load of trapdoors, uh, we can go and just put them uh, all the way up the sides. It looks like someone's doing already a great job there. So we're going to need to make absolutely loads of them. And there's your shovel down there, Lee. Are you okay, Lee? <laughs> what, what, what's up with you? Uh, so let's, let's go and make as many trapdoors as we can. So I'm going to make all of my wood into wooden planks. I'm going to make all of those wooden planks uh, into into trap doors and there's a load of trees around here if people uh, need to, to grab any more wood uh, but first I'm going to very quickly try and invite all of my Minecraft helpers uh, back into the game. Okay, everyone's managed to get back in. <laughs> I just saw Chloe there plummeting and whoa, look, she's almost on trapdoors completely uh, up one of the, the sides there. So uh, I think Lee's there desperately cutting down trees so we can get more wood because you do need uh, absolutely loads. Uh, I think I should hopefully uh, just about have enough to, to build up to the, the top this side and then I might be able to do it. I might actually be able to completely finish and play a mini game all in one video. All I need to do is just sort of pile my way up here and uh, do the same on all of the other sides and then we have done it then we, we have successfully managed to completely build a mini game <laughs> if I didn't do it myself and if I didn't see it then I wouldn't have believed it so let me just go and uh, pile the the whole way up here I think I should uh, just about have enough trap doors to do this side and then hopefully my Minecraft helpers are gonna have enough wood in them uh, to do the ones on the other side and here we go now we can admire the view here's my fun land my fun land from the skies we got there's the uh, the top pour assault course fish me a dish bouncy boats we got flower power down there sheer fun it's a lovely world after all my circus all of these amazing things and uh, oh you can't just about see my house but my house is uh, just over there somewhere and I can see there Lee making his way up that side and so this is the last side here so very carefully let's go into the water and oh that is scary <laughs> even though I know it's safe uh, it is still scary so I don't have a, enough wood to completely finish building up that side does anyone else have any spare wood on them I think people are, are desperately running around cutting down trees and I think I <laughs> I might go and join them as well there's some there's some massive trees over here uh, that we can go and cut down and uh, we shouldn't need too much I think we need uh, I think it's about uh, 40 trap doors to go and do each side so uh, if we all compile all of our resources together and then one person goes up to do that that final side so if everyone just gets all their wood and they just throw it to me I'm just gonna go and make it into a whole load of trap doors and uh, hop up and do that final side and then we can do it then we can go and play Tower Tumble the first ever game uh, of Tower Tumble I'm actually really looking forward to this I think it's uh, actually gonna be a uh, a really good fun game and uh, after spending a, a whole video working building as fast as you can it, uh, it's a nice reward to actually get to, to play what it is you were building and I hear arrows flying at me like crazy I thought that might be you Lee is that you trying to get my attention <laughs> if you just leave them in a, in a pile down here I can grab them all let's see how many we got oh we got quite a lot Lee's got uh, over a stack of uh, wooden planks there. All right, let's see how many trap doors I can make out of this. This should hopefully uh, be enough. And we need to have, make sure they're all flapped down as well. They can't be flapped up like that. You see this side, they're all... If someone... Uh, Lee, if you go and pile up that side maybe and flap them all up and uh, maybe go and fill in the, the rest of that row. Looks like uh, Wee Wee's thrown some, some more wood down here. So let's go and make all of this wood into planks. And uh, see how many uh, trap doors I'm going to be able to make out of it. We've got like every different type of wood in my world here. <laughs> we got birch, oak, and of course, spruce. And look how many wooden planks and uh, um, how many trap doors I'm making. There we go. I got over a stack. This should be uh, more than enough. So let's go and do uh, this side here first. As uh, seen as uh, this side here hasn't really got any. And uh, then I'm going to go and uh, fill in that, that last final row, I guess. So if I try and get lined up right, then just keep jumping, keep jumping, keep jumping. Oh no, no, Chloe just went and flapped them all 
down. I'm going to have to go and flap them all back up. They all need to be the way they are on these sides. They can't be uh, flapped up like that. <laughs> if you just jump down, Chloe, that's the easiest way to get down uh, rather than going and flapping them because otherwise we're going to have to reset it every time. All right, so let me just go and uh, make my way up here, uh, flapping all of these up, well, placing all of these, and uh, then we can go and fill in that one last final go. And uh, yeah, then we can go and play the, the first game. So uh, I'm trying to think of that. If I go just jump down to here, then I can kind of go and flap my way up. And then when I get to the, the top, I can just go and place those those final few. There we go. I think this is going to be the easiest way to do it. And then everyone else can can pick a side and we can get ready to do the first game. So just to go over the, the rules one final time. It's basically first person to the top of the tower wins uh, just by doing the whole jumping and flapping trick. <laughs> and uh, you can flap the people uh, next to you uh, to try and knock them down, but you're not allowed to attack or hit or try and knock anyone off directly. Uh, you can only try and uh, hinder their progress uh, by doing the, the the flapping to try and knock them down a little bit. And oh, I thought I ran out there, but I do have uh, uh, loads more on me here. And here we go. Everything's set. Let's do it. We managed to completely finish the game. So everyone uh, hop down to the bottom. Uh, I think Chloe's going to go and dive off the, the tower now. Is she going? Is she still up there going? Big jump. Woo! <laughs> she was eating as she fell. <laughs> that can't be good. Right, so if everyone goes and picks a side, I think I'm going to go on uh, this side here. And we can go and play the first game of Tower Tumble. We will begin in three, two, one. We, we get in place. Go! And we're all oh, Chloe and Lee are waiting for no one. Right, let me just go immediately go and just flap Lee straight into the water there. <laughs> That was good fun. Oh, he tried to get me back. He tried to get me back immediately. I can't get up. I can't even get on that first one. He keeps flapping me down. <laughs> this isn't good. Oh, Lee just flapped himself down there. And there we go. I finally got off that bottom row. But Chloe's making good progress. And oh, no, Lee flapped me back down again. <laughs> Are you going to be my nemesis for this, Lee? Have you got it in for me? Right, let's go and try and flap Lee down then, shall we? Oh, no, I know he's going to get me back. Truce, Lee. Look, Chloe's getting miles ahead. Wee Wee and Lee, you guys need to try and catch up with Chloe. Because I can't do anything to her. Because she's on the opposite side. I can't really get her. One of us is going to have to catch up. Otherwise, she is going to win. She is getting miles Miles ahead. Right, I'm going to call a truce for you now, Lee. Just as long as you can knock Chloe down, it will benefit both of us. <laughs> oh, I'm doing rubbish here. I'm doing rubbish. I'm doing this so slowly. I think if you go and flap a load of them and then just keep jumping, I think that's the easiest way to do it. So flap, 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 and then jump, flap, jump, flap, jump, flap, jump, flap, 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 flap. Here we go. I'm actually starting to catch up on Chloe. I can't see where Wee Wee is. I think he might be down in the bottom. I can't see Lee, but I can hear him very close behind me. So even if I don't get first, I'd like to at least get second. But Chloe is steaming ahead here. I think her tactic was to just ignore everyone else. And she's done it. Chloe has got already to the top. So let me see if I can come in second. I think Lee's so close to hop behind me. And there we go. I came in second. <laughs> and yay! My reward is a glass of milk. Num, 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 num. You can have a piece of bread. And here comes Lee about to come into third place. And Wee Wee is still all the way down at the bottom. I think he's been having a bit of trouble. Hi, Lee! Welcome to the top of the tower. What a view it is. <laughs> Let's go down and say hi to Wee Wee, shall we? There he is. <laughs> he made it about seven blocks high. <laughs> oh dear. So that, that's the game. So we still got a few things to sort out. We're obviously a bit mucked up here, but uh, overall I really enjoyed it. I'm looking forward to, uh, to maybe coming back in the future and playing this game again. Uh, but sadly, that is the end of this video here. I want to thank you all very much for watching and I will see you all later.